<laughs> what's up y'all what's going on just finished having a little bit of lunch um i see that prime is a little upset that he couldn't find his team or tennessee state's name on the ticker espn ticker that's when on the bottom of the screen they show all the scores of the schools that that played prime was a little upset because he couldn't find the score of the tennessee state grambling game and he was talking about the images of the game. He couldn't find certain things that okay. them Power 5 schools are accustomed to. But Prime, you need to realize that they don't, they don't look at uh, black college football the same way they, as they look at Power 5 schools. Heck, I was... But even though they're not treating us like Power 5 conferences and teams, it's getting better. You got swag football on ESPN like every week. So eventually, you'll get the photographers, Gaddy and all that. They'll start taking pictures of the games. But it's baby steps. But look, swag football's on every week. So a lot of progress is being made. But it's crazy how HBCU's gotta fight for everything. Here you got the football game on during the weekend but you can't find other football games in the SWAT, but you can't, you can't find the score or games on the ticker. But yeah, but it's getting better though. Prime is doing a great job trying to get everything on a power five level as far as the coverage, uniforms and everything, everything else. But let me get back into this job. I'll talk to these guys later, it's Corner Sports Night.